Hey guys, welcome to another edition of Gaming Night. I uh, just wanted to do this update for today, let you know what's going on. Uh, like I said, I finished the King's Quest up, uh, Chapter 4, so that one's completed. Um, I put up an episode of Heavy Rain. I also uploaded part uh, 1 of my playthrough of a game that I told you about that was a surprise for Halloween, around Halloween, so that one's up. And I'm working on um, just finishing up right now. Uh, I'm going to be uploading uh, awesome board games in my collection in another episode. So that's going to go up today. So sometime today that will be up. So this update is part of uh, up videos. Uh, then uh, this coming up next week I'm going to figure out what's going on. i got a few things planned. I'm not sure if it's going to go well or not. I hit. The, I have a lot of work hours this week due to some stuff going on. So, so I'm not going to disclose that over here. So, got some stuff going on. So, I'm um, hoping to get some more uh, board game stuff up for you guys, uh, as well as some video game stuff. So this, this month is going to be a pretty good month for uh, horror and other residents that I'm planning on playing so I gotta go through my collection see what I got and we'll go from there um, but anything that's for the that happens for the PS4 I'll definitely have to play that um, if I can think of it I'll try to get to playing some stuff um, so that's about it it's just a pretty quick update um, waiting for some stuff to come in uh, and a whole bunch of other goodies. So, I do want to talk a little bit about King's Quest Chapter 4. Uh, the, snow, the snow place like home. Uh, pretty much did a lot of uh, like character development in that one. Uh, did a good job with that. The puzzles weren't like... Um, like impossible uh, the, they weren't like it was kinda weird they weren't like uh, the regular King's Quest type puzzles these were more like logic puzzles and we physically had objects that you were moving around there was a couple like riddles and stuff in there but it was a pretty much straightforward game and then that's like the, the end of it now there's like one more episode that's the epilogue that's left we don't know when that one's coming out so and then that's gonna wrap up the entire series of the King's Quest um, but I do enjoy the games I mean they, they they're trying something different for the modern gamer the, the newer gamers to so hope and the younger ones that aren't that aren't weren't familiar with the King's Quest game so in a whole they did a good job with that and they got a lot of backstory a lot, of, a lot of stuff from the other games, so there's a lot of reference to the, the games that from the previous ones back in the day. So I got a lot of those references that were pretty nice. Um, uh, so uh, it's a little bit. It was a little bit longer than the other one. I think uh, the shortest game was, uh, was it ch chapter two. I think chapter two or three was the shortest one so far. I think it was, yeah, two was the shortest. Um, the third one was a little bit longer, but not as long as the first one. I think the first one was the longest one. Because it had a bigger story to tell. I'm hoping the epilogue is a really long one. Because um, it should hopefully cover everything that, to wrap up everything up. Cause there's definitely a lot of stuff going on, and and this the third the the fourth game they had a lot of stuff going on, and with the character development, I'm not gonna spoil it, but there was like a lot of stuff that they gotta resolve, and uh, hopefully they'll come up with something else and uh, continue the the series with maybe something else or do another Sierra game like um, Space Quest or something like that, but. Um, so yeah, that's about it. Um, I hope to see you guys next time and, uh, thanks for watching.